the 26th of February, 2016. It's 8.35 a.m., and I just watched the latest LEGO Dimensions Let's Play and made the notes. I was actually up till 2 o'clock last night watching Critical Role. They had a pretty interesting thing that I just couldn't tear myself away from. Because they had one member at a funeral and a bunch of the rest of them caught con crud from their latest visit, it means that they had sick and absent people. So with the people that were there, they did an arena setup where he put them in an arena and made them fight each other just to battle it out just for fun. I won't spoil the outcome for anyone that wants to see it, but man, that was epic. My arm is actually feeling a bit better this morning. I think I know the main thing that's making it get better over time. Whenever I go to sleep, I'm supposed to extend it wrist up beside me and just straight out. No bending, no anything, just straight out. I think those stretches of time where it's just stretching out... My Avengers is done with something. Uh, but it's stretching out, not having to bend, is working. And cold. You haven't experienced a full spot of the night, Doctor. You don't know what cold is until you have. And you're inside shelter. Right, but not here. There are Daleks and Spartan slave workers. I found something disturbing while we were watching Doctor Who. This is a Dalek facility. The Daleks are in the Diamond Club! Guys, I have a problem, and you can already hear it. My Sonic's stuck on the on position. This is supposed to do it. I don't know what to do! There, I fixed it. I opened up the battery compartment, wiggled it around until it got it out of place, and that fixed it. A real screwdriver for a Sonic one. Irony. Well, it's gonna take a while to build all that, but it's finally time. Unikitty has arrived. She's apparently needed all over the dang place from what we've seen. She came with a rather, let's call it, interesting vehicle. A Lego character that was past my time being in Legos. Makes me feel old, but hey, the kids still gotta make up new stuff. Okay, so that's slightly adorable. Slightly. Now we get to the Lord of the Rings portion of all of this. Little Gimli. I only know him by name. Mom's the Lord of the Rings person. Dwarf! And with him came a little cart, which is actually axe-themed. Kinda cute. And here he is, the great defier of physics himself, Legolas. Elf. And for a vehicle, they gave Legolas his very own arrow launcher. Interesting. And then finally, we have Gollum. Smeagol. <laughs> <laughs> and Gollum comes with Shalob the Great. Again, don't know, apparently according to Mom, it's very appropriate. Look at all those spare parts. Luckily, I have a mug that those will go on just fine. We're going to go inside and eat because all that building made us hungry. If we've got time, we'll play us a level, and if not, there's always Sunday. We just tried out Craig Ferguson's new show on History Channel, Join or Die. If you like history and you like Craig Ferguson, oh yeah, give it a shot. It's hilarious. I'm getting a bit of an obsessiveness with these things. Every now and then I get a pop at the beginning of one. You don't know how many times I've had to redo a snap just because of that pop. Drives me nuts. Getting ready for Texland. We actually get to do it this week. Kind of good, because Apple overshadowed everything, so we get to do a little bit of last week this week. Had a great episode of Slant this time. It was fantastic. Talked about the Apple thing, of course. Not so black and white as a lot of people think.